Before I get to the video, if you guys are looking to get a controller for Call of Duty Mobile, I highly recommend the Mobile Claw. I'll put a link down below. They partnered with my channel, and I literally use this controller trigger every single day when I play Call of Duty Mobile. So make sure you guys go ahead and check it out and use code TRIZ at checkout. What's up, guys? The new Call of Duty Mobile update is here. I'll be showing exactly how to download it, um, how to get it for your device. Whether if you guys are on Android or if you guys are on iOS as well too, um, I'll talk about that. So, um, anyway, so before I get to the actual tutorial on how to actually download the update, a lot of you guys are wondering how to actually get or download it, how to play it. Um, I want to do a quick overview exactly of the new update because this is insane. We got a new update today. It's August 15th. Um, the time I'm recording this is like 8 in the morning, but I actually got my hands on it. Like the update rolled out around, I think like 4 a.m. I'm not quite sure. But uh, it's been out for a couple hours now, and uh, a lot of stuff has changed, and it's insane. It's really, really cool. Um, so first things first, if you guys played the old beta, the beta that was before this one, do not worry, your uh, tier, your battle pass, your progression, your your rank, whatever, is saved. Because um, I was, I, I think I'm tier 58 on the battle pass. I still have my COD points, don't worry. My like C is still there, whatever that's called. And my rank, which is 61, is still there. So my progressions are still the same. Uh, they actually included some new stuff. They have like the new like parachutes, um, the color of the parachutes. I think they added in different types of stuff as well too in the normal ranking system. Like wingsuit, I think this is new too. I don't remember the wingsuits being in the game. So that is pretty cool. I mean, there was wingsuits in Black Ops 4, so it does make sense we're getting wingsuits in this game as well too. So that's pretty awesome. Um, there's also like different types of like, um, like guns as well too. Like, whoa, look at this, man. That's a, a zombie gene parachute bro this is this makes me want to grind even harder man this is nuts so anyways though there's uh new parachutes new items new customization options um you guys can see i have like the backpack rolling on my character here um there's one thing too i highly recommend i kind of feel cheated a little bit i hope that um they actually tencent fix this is or activision gives us a little cod points back i'm not sure but basically there's a thing called cash back where basically if you purchase cod points if you get cod points you actually get these items for free so it's kind of like a fortnite starter pack if you guys are familiar with fortnite starter packs it's just like that so essentially you're gonna buy the cod points anyways might as well get cod points and get free items to go along with it so you get like a backpack uh, a free knife if you, and like a spray depending on what intervals of uh, cod points you get so I kind of feel cheated out in my way. Come on, man. Give, give us give us the points back or give us those items for free if you already purchased stuff. Because I already bought quite a bit of COD points and I spent a little bit of it. So, I don't know. I'm kind of I'm kind of upset. But um, anyways, there's also the brand new, um, there's like the store here. I'll show you guys. They're, they have weapon crates. Obviously, it, it's it's an, an, an inevitable. Is that, is that the right word? We knew. We knew we were getting weapon points. Um, there's also vehicle camos. Um, look at this. The, this is brand new too. The orange ATV. I, be, I believe this is new. This is kind of that's actually really wavy, bro. That's sick. Um, elite PMC. The character. That's pretty awesome. Um, there's also look at this guy. A pink ATV. That is actually really cool looking too. I like that a lot. I'm, I mean, I barely drive vehicles anyways. Oh no 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 no. I'm not. I'm not about to buy that. Uh, I barely buy vehicles anyways. Here's a pink helicopter. That's pretty awesome. Uh, pixel sprays. I don't know why you'd spend COD points on pixel sprays. Uh, pink boat. Speed boat. That's sick. And then a neon scout. That's pretty awesome as well too. That, so, I mean, they're really up in their game. They're obviously going to try monetizing the crap out of this game. Um, it's a free game. You know, everyone's like hating Call of Duty Mobile. Like, oh, why are they charging for... Um, for all this stuff dude like the game's free man you know like the game is completely free you, you know if you play the game you're gonna have the same experience um as everyone else man if, if you buy cosmetics it won't matter um here's some new camos by the way this is pretty cool actually i'll just kind of scroll through them you'll, you'll i mean when you guys play the game yourself you'll, you'll be you can download it and check it out for yourself uh, i believe this is a new camo that's pretty cool the lemon drop candy that looks pretty awesome the ak that looks really cool, actually. That's awesome, man. Um, so, yeah. So, I mean, obviously... And, and they added to this, too. That's actually really cool. So, now you can actually, like, rank up. You can grind out and get these camos for free. 
So that's pretty cool. I, and I can actually buy it. Dude, this, I can actually afford some of this stuff. Let's go, baby. I'm going to have to purchase one of these things. That's insane. So you get some free items as well, too. So that's pretty cool. Um, so anyways, though, too, in the loadout section, you guys can see. Oh, wait. I'll quick go back. Um, the zombie thing, the zombie icon here changed. It looks a little different. Multiplayer, I believe, is the same. Battle Royale got optimized. The, the graphics look super good in that. Um, if you go into the loadout here, um, I'll quick jump on a loadout I don't really care about. You unlock all the loadouts already. Previously, it was locked, but the thing that's locked now is the perks. So you can still have separate loadouts. So you just won't be able to add perks to it. So that's kind of interesting. Um, so then also, too, I just want to quick show you guys. We have a brand new gun. Um, this is the AK-11 or AK-117. And it, I'm going to try it out, too. We can go ahead and equip it. We can check it out, of course. So that's pretty awesome. You can go ahead and equip it. So that's pretty cool. Um, I think we get optics already. That's kind of weird. We already get optics on this gun. I don't know. I don't know why they gave us optics. Interesting. Kind of interested in that. But um, so that's pretty cool. Also, um, I think I got a free knife, a rocket launcher. This is the new A or what is this called? The FHJ rocket launcher is brand new. So that's pretty cool. And then there's also daily rewards. Um, so you actually can get free daily rewards. Here's my wingsuit. I already unlocked this one, so I'm going to equip this one. That's for Battle Royale, of course. We'll go ahead and equip that. My parachute, I already unlocked the parachute, which is this yellow one. We'll go ahead and equip the parachute, which is cool. And then my weapon, vehicle stuff. So I already have some camos. That is actually awesome. So uh, what, what, I don't know I don't know why it's like this must be just kind of just showing that it's new, that we can customize this stuff. So that is awesome. And then, of course, we got the emotes going. Um, coming up, I'm gonna equip this guy. I don't know why I should have just equipped everything here. Clutched up, pop lock. Dude, I I, I should have equipped this stuff a long time ago. But I'll, I'll equip it on my own time. Um, so yeah, that's basically it. There's also clans. Um, by the way, guys, I I'll make another video later on. But um, let me know if you guys have in any interest in joining a clan. It's not like an official like clan, like clan battle. We're gonna battle other clans right now. It's mostly just to level up and rank up because I'm actually part of a clan, if you guys do not know. I'm um, a team, an organization. I'll explain that in another video. I, I haven't really discussed it on this channel yet, but um, I'll talk about that because I know a lot of you guys are kind of interested in that. So anyways, though, uh, let's go back. Um, and yeah, let's go ahead and check out another map. The new map got released today as well, too. It's called Take Off. Um, we'll jump in a game here. I'll, I'll snipe for you guys. We'll see how it's going. I, I, like I said, this is the first time I'm playing this map. So, um, we'll see how it is. Alright, well, this is pretty new layout. I mean, everything looks super refined and, like, smooth and clean cut now. Uh, it looks very optimized. I don't know if that's just me or I'm tripping out, but, yeah, this is super exciting, actually. So, anyways, if you guys are unaware, this is actually, uh, Call of Duty's Black Ops 2 remake map. Um, so I actually played on this map back in, on the 360. So that is actually, whoa, whoa, what the heck was that, man? That was kind of, that was trippy. So this already, this map already existed. So I'm, I mean, for the most part, like, I like this map. It's pretty cool. I mean, I can't, I can't really complain. Even though a lot of people are like, oh, we should have Call of Duty Mobile Shadow its own maps. In my honest opinion, guys, I think it, I mean, we already have some, that one S&D map is like completely like just for Black, or for Call of Duty Mobile, which is fine. Um, my honest opinion, if you play Call of Duty Mobile, a lot of casual people that are gonna pick it up and play it aren't gonna take the time to learn the new maps. Um, they're probably just gonna jump on and play and, I mean, they're probably gonna be really happy to be familiar with the, with the map rather than jump on and be unfamiliar with the map. So, I think for now, it's best for the community. Will we have separate exclusive maps? 100% most likely. I got. I kind of messed up my controls here. What the heck? Give me a second, man. I kind of forgot about that. I gotta get used to that. So, uh, normally I have my. <laughs> I'm sorry. I'm sorry. Normally I have my my jump button here, or my slide button here, and my uh, aim button here. But I accidentally. I, yeah. Every update you have to like redo your controls, which kind of sucks. But um, I'm so used to sliding with my other my other finger on my trigger so i'll have to fix that out by the way guys 
like I said, um, I highly recommend these triggers, especially if you guys are coming from the mobile or from uh, from Xbox, I should say. You guys seriously are gonna like love this stuff. You're gonna absolutely love these triggers. Like it's, it feels so nice. By the way, this is my first game of the day too. Like I, I mean, you guys are probably gonna roast me in the comment section and be like, "Dude, you're trash at the game. Get better at the game." Dude, I literally just woke up and turned record on and made this video for you guys. So, I mean. I'm sorry. I'm sorry if my, my game, if I, I'm not like popping off like I normally do. Um, it takes me about like maybe a, a, two games to get really good or like get get in the swing of things again, man. You know, like it's like you, you don't you don't perform your best when you're uh, when you just get on, right? So I don't know. So takeoff is pretty sick. Like just playing it how it is, like it's pretty awesome. It is exactly how I do remember it from my, the old Call of Duty Black Ops 2. So that's good. Um, I used to play competitive. Black Ops 2. I, I, mean, I might have to do a story time for you guys for that one. But uh, I used to play competitively on Call of Duty Black Ops 2 and other Call of Duty games. Um, so, I mean, for the most part, dude, like this map feels good. Um, optimization wise, I can definitely tell there is an increase. The graphics do look a lot better than they do before. I don't think you guys can tell from the recording. Um, oh, jeepers. There we go. Nice. I don't know if you guys can tell from the recordings or anything like that. Um, cause I'm, I was, I'm trying to increase my quality of recording. I need to like, I don't know, I have to do something to get my, my OBS settings a little bit better. But, uh, I don't know if you guys can tell, it does look very, very good. Like, whoa, what the heck? That's new. They really want me to use my kill streak. That's pretty funny, actually. That's, that's awesome. So, but like, literally everything about this game just feels so much smoother, cleaner. Like the font, the text, everything just looks so much better. The, even the buttons to press looks really good. Um, some complaints I've already noticed just by playing this game. Um, I still have noticed a little bit of issue with the um, with like the, the screen, where like I think it, it might just be the gun. I'm not quite sure, but like I, I have noticed that. Oh come on, man, get off me. I have noticed like sometimes I'll be aiming down my sight and then the screen will ra randomly flick up. Maybe it's just I'm I'm just I don't know. I I'm drinking too much coffee and my finger is flicking up too fast for the screen. I could be like I don't know, just completely overthinking it, but I don't know. I think I feel like that's like the only optimization that I can see happen with this with the gameplay so far. But I mean, right now, dudes, like I think it's it feels really smooth. It feels really good. Um, feels a lot better than the last like beta or the last update. So that's a good thing. We're seeing some improvements. We're seeing some improvements. See like that, how like I aimed on my sight and it randomly floated up. I don't know about that, man. That's kind of that's a little bit trippy right there. That's a little bit trippy here. I'm just gonna throw this thing here. But yeah, man. So it's gonna be kind of interesting. Like I said before, um it's still soft launched. I, I know my videos, I literally was still talking about it. I know some other YouTubers are making promises that there's going to be global release this week. I never promised there's going to be global release. Um, just because I knew going in that, I mean, it's probably going to be... People are going to expect the global release to find out it's not globally released. They did add a new country, which is Peru, which is really good. I'll, I mean, I have, I have a, I'll have another explanation um, why everything occurred, occurred this way in this update. So, I'll have that later, but... Final kill cam? Did we have final kill cams in the last update? I don't, I don't really remember. What the heck? Maybe, I don't, dude, that might be new. That might be new too. Holy smokes, dude! This is a super awesome update. This is crazy. Holy smokes, man! Drop it a thirty bomb to start the day. You know how it is, man. You know how it is. But that's pretty cool. There's also gun game. This is a brand new map or game mode too. I'll play a little bit for you guys so you guys can see what it looks like. So, whoa, I just jumped into a match here. That's pretty sick. So gun game, if you guys don't know what gun game is, it's uh, essentially, um, it, it's like, it's free for all. But once you guys get a kill, then you, you rank up a gun. So every single time you guys get a kill, you're going to get a new gun. So that's pretty sick. So I got a new gun here. New gun. There we go. I'll just straight up dominate. Ew, they even come with the camos too? That is actually, that's super clutch, man. That is super clutch, dude. Um, but normally, I think normally when, when you actually play gun game in normal Call of Duty games, I don't think they give you camos. So it's kind of interesting actually um, that they actually gave out camos for this. So that's pretty cool. That's really cool actually. Um, but like I was saying though too, it's probably just a big tease <laughs> um i'll 
uh, dude, I have so many videos I can talk about with Call of Duty Mo or Call of Duty in general. Um, they literally are probably they they're making they're this is not an accident that they're giving us these camos for for gun game. It is 100% like a big tease for us to they, they want us to basically play with these camos, fall in love with them cuz you can only play with them for like what, a couple seconds and then and then you get a kill or you get killed. So you don't get them the whole game obviously. So they're definitely just teasing these camos for us. So we want to actually go ahead and either buy them or level up and get cod points or whatever. So this is not an accident that they're giving us camos for <laughs> for free with gun game. So that is kind of interesting that they actually are giving us this stuff. So that's pretty cool. But they look cool, man. They look they look extra fly. I believe these camos are I don't I look based on what I've been seeing, I don't think all these camos are um like the you have to buy cod points. I think some of them if you little like if you play enough, you'll actually get them. So that's kind of cool. Um, so like I mean they are teasing them pretty good, but it's not completely out of reach of actually getting them. So even if you guys don't want to spend money on the game, it is still possible to get these camos for free. So that is pretty neat. I'm not gonna lie, it's pretty cool. So uh, let's see, is there someone chilling this way? Oh, I've never used that gun actually. The gun I just got a kill with, I don't think I've ever used it. Let's see here. Um, quick slide. And I don't know, I, I guess I, I still have to mix up my controls, dude. I'm not used to this. My controls are all messed up. I gotta fix that next game, of course. But I figure as long as I was just showing you guys the update, might as well just continue to keep showing it. But yeah, that's like the update, guys. I think a lot of you guys are really going to enjoy it. Um, I would show you guys Battle Royale, but it's kind of self-explanatory. Um, it got optimized. Everything does look a lot better than it did before. Including, I think we got some new stuff for the loadout here. Uh, that makes sense. The camos for the vehicles are in the loadouts as well, too. So, anyways, though, that is so exciting, guys. Like, personally, I think it's a good update. Um, there's still some stuff, obviously, that's not completely optimized. I will have some more global release information and news. Also, too, our ranks are, like, our actual rank rank. Like, rank match ranks got reset. So, I'll probably grind out some rank matches for you guys on, like, stream or something like that. Um, but, yeah. But, anyways, go. I wanted to give you guys a quick update video talking about the brand new Call of Duty mobile update that just released today. It's really exciting. I'm really pumped for this thing. It looks great. And, uh, and yeah. So, anyways, though, thanks for watching the video. We'll catch you guys later. Have an awesome day, guys. Take it easy, man. Peace out.